there, my name is Dr. Marissa May. In this video, we're gonna be adding two fifths plus three eighths. Now, when we have fractions that have common uh, denominators that are not alike, we have to find a common denominator. So we're gonna look for what's called the least common multiple. I'm gonna list out multiples of five and eight until I can get one that is the same. So we'll skip count by fives, so five, 10, 15, 20, 25, 30, we've got to keep going until we get one that will be in the eight. Okay, then we'll skip count by eights, eight, 16, 24, 32, 40. Oh, I've got one now. So 40 is going to be my common denominator. Next, let's take two fifths and make it have a 40 in its denominator. And then we'll take three eighths and make it have a 40 in its denominator. So to convert two fifths, we'll ask ourselves five times what would give me 40? So that's five times eight. If I multiply the bottom by eight, I have to multiply the top by eight. So two times eight gives me 16. Then we'll do the same with three eighths. Eight times five gives me 40. So we'll multiply the top by five. Three times five gives me 15. So really this problem becomes 16 fortieths plus 15 fortieths. And we add the tops now. 16 plus 15 gives me 31. And we leave the denominators alone. So we get 31 over 40 here. I hope this helps you with forming a least common multiple that helps you then form a common denominator. And you can add your fractions. Bye for now. Thank you.